Okay, this is Falcon's Nest. This is a 20 by 100 triple decker. Uh, the third deck is 20 by 60. We've got a new awning. Our canopy coming for the aluminum frame right there that covers over the front porch. So that's going to be, uh, that's got a new blue awning to match these blue stripes coming right here. And as you can see, this is a massive ship. It's got Conrad, Conrad outdrives, uh, four Cummins diesel engines, and three decks. Deck one, deck two, deck three. All right, we'll go into the... This is a water closet here. It's got uh, all the power connections there. All right, this is this is stepping into the front door. So, all this is uh, basically. Nine, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. This is seven uh, sliding doors in the front entry room that you can open all these sliding doors. It has all the screen to close. So this is like the front sunroom that a lot of people have. But uh, this is all totally in encased with heat and air conditioning. And you can close it all up have it air conditioned or you can open all the doors and have all the fresh air come in so this is the front entry room and then you've got uh, double French doors going into the main boat area there's a intercom system that goes to all the rooms there's the hailer and scanner with the CB radio so you can talk to people outside the boat and uh, whatever some lights there then this is the living room area the woodwork is all cherry and maple and it's got an alarm system power center I think that's a 75 inch TV maybe something like that then it's got all granite countertops a um, little bit of blue speckles in the countertop to match the carpet um, got beveled glass on the back tile splash area got a commercial grade uh, hood vent and smooth induction top got a trash compactor, double sink with garbage disposal, dishwasher. Uh, I think there's a Lazy Susan back there. No, no Lazy Susan. And a ice maker. And as you can see, tons of storage in the kitchen. Absolutely beautiful maple and cherry wood it's got a uh, double oven over here convection microwave oven and then a regular electric oven both KitchenAid this top microwave is just only a year old um, over here it's got all these cabinet drawers that pull out um, so you've got easy access to all your uh, canned goods, pantry, more here, and then that's where we keep the good stuff. Then you've got a beautiful chandelier, and this is your view for dining, looking out at the lake, 
and the sun will be setting in about an hour. But as you can see, absolutely beautiful view. It doesn't get any better than that. Uh, walking down the hallway, we have one bed uh, bathroom across from one king size bedroom. I'll go in there in a second. We've got Raritan uh, macerator toilet, nice big shower. And of course, uh, great view. These, all the windows have these uh, pull down blinds. And then we also have uh, blackout curtains for the front of the boat, both the front entry room, the living room, and the dining room, if you really want it to be no light in the boat. And a double vanity in this bathroom. Then here's one bedroom. King size bed, storage under the bed, closet over in the corner, um, indirect lighting up top, and can lighting, both with a ceiling fan. And over there you've got your intercom phone to call the other rooms. This is just a hall closet. This is the laundry room with washer and dryer. There's a uh, drop down folding or a drop down ironing table and iron in there another awesome view of the lake and that is a laundry chute coming down from the master bedroom which is upstairs we call the captain's quarters and you got more cabinets uh, utility sink and more cabinets walking on down the hall you've got another Raritan Atlantis macerator toilet um, another shower, just basically the same size as the front bathroom. Another great view, drop down shade, and another his and hers vanity with plenty of storage. Across from that, you have another king size bedroom, closet on this side, uh, the intercom, king size bed and nightstands on each side just like the other bedroom two windows in here this looks out on the back deck we're doing some cleaning today that's the back deck okay walking down the hall we're going to go upstairs to the captain's quarters and As you can see, this is absolutely beautiful staircase, cherry wood, acorn handles. Um, the fit and finish on this staircase is absolutely perfection. Beautiful. Uh, the boat has all commercial doors. Um, very heavy duty double insulated glass and there's the upstairs view here's the helm we've got uh, one drive engine another drive engine and this is your thrusters engine depth finder navigation and it does have autopilot but i've never used it There's your uh, control for your thrusters with these two joysticks here and your engine controls. Again, another intercom system phone and this is a drop down TV that gives you front and rear cameras and also side cameras so you can see to bring the ship in. And there's your helm then we have an absolutely beautiful uh, table here with all granite countertop the beauty of this granite is just incredible see all the veins and lines and sparkle and another I think 65 inch TV there 
And then we have the upstairs kitchen. You got another refrigerator, a ice maker, trash compactor, and dishwasher, along with a sink, microwave, coffee pot. Again, you've got the uh, indirect lighting and ceiling fan and can lights here. Uh, and right here is another bathroom. This is the third bathroom. This is the only bathroom that only has one vanity here, as you can see. Another rare to Atlantis toilet and another awesome view of the lake. All right. This is the front deck. I'll just kind of peek through the windows right now. This is one side. This is the other side. Got a couple loungers and like a little tea table there. And we've got, uh, this is where we've got the new awning coming for this area here. That'll all be covered. Then we walk down the hallway to the master bedroom. This is a utility closet. It's got the central vacuum system in it. Um, all along the boat, upstairs and downstairs, you have central vac. You just plug into those and you can vacuum the whole boat. Super powerful vacuum. Then we've got his and hers closet. This is the master bedroom. Cedar lined closets. Then we have, I think, a 90-inch TV in here. Um, there's a window behind that, but uh, it's blocked off. If you want the window, you can take the TV down, but uh, right now there's a 90-inch TV in front of it. And an office, chair, beautiful granite countertops, built-in chest of drawers, and desk. Uh, here's the master bed. King size as well, and beautiful view of the lake, as you can see. And again, the intercom phone, in case you want to call downstairs or ring your butler or whatever. Then there is a Dometic Master Flush toilet. That toilet's uh, less than two years old with a bidet which is pretty incredible. There's the bidet controls and the toilet controls. And a jetted tub. Works great with this uh, shower tower with a rainmaker, waterfall, misters, hand wand, um, tub fill, a whole deal. And another Awesome view of the lake and double vanity with plenty of storage. And then that leads us to the back second deck. Where there's a staircase that goes up to the third deck and the back sitting area to watch the sunset. Absolutely beautiful view of Table Rock Lake. Okay, going up the stairs to the third deck. This is the third deck. We've got, it's pretty high up here. Got a little uh, netted area to keep stuff on top of the boat. Um, but this is a 60 foot by 20 foot top deck. Furuno navigation, etc. And there's a view of the lake, and there's looking down 
this is how high we are. You don't quite realize how high you are until you get up here and then you're right, uh, then you realize you don't want to fall off of that. And there's, there's the uh, height of your normal houseboat. There it is, Falcon's Nest.